really ah uh, the the Klingon should be teching up here um, th th they are hanging out on sayings and slowly losing their fleet little by little little by little so in the process we get to see the vet Got Begs class, and it's a nice little passive. Don't get to see these very often. This little sucker is a tank and a half. Uh, again, we have the Vet Cavort, just this nasty little bugger here. And um, a lot of experience for the Klingons. A lot of unnecessary deaths, too. Klingons, total missed opportunity as we wait for the Klingons to mobilize. And as they mobilize kind of slowly, again, with some engine issues here, some engine issues here, the Klingons would be really well served if they put a forward base somewhere. That would be a draw for the Federation. You can see the Federation slowly getting an Akira fleet. My oh my, my oh my. What? Are the Klingons waiting for? Are the Klingons waiting for a glorious battle? Because they're just going to continue doing that unless they seal the deal. They need to seal the deal. So yeah, folks, the, um, the Federation slowly continuing to build up, having lost so much. The Klingons building up slowly, um, not taking advantage of the opportunities that they've had. And this is sort of the result. Now, in all fairness, these guys both admitted that, you know, that they're relatively new, and so sometimes I am giving them crap um, for... Uh, doing doing what comes naturally when you first pick up this game um, it is the finding the right balance of offensive versus defensive is actually kind of hard as you don't want to risk losing ships uh, you you end up being too aggressive and your opponent takes advantage of that. Um, those are all very valid concerns here, but at the same time, you can be too defensive, uh, too conservative, and so it's a big, it's a, it's a fine line here. And the Klingons here are are built around being aggressive to a, a large degree. These cavorts are great raiders. They they need to come in here and start raiding stuff. Um, Blazing Gig was doing a great job of microing earlier, has kind of slacked off over the course of the game, ends up losing ships, uh, probably having an issue with managing this large number. And that can be a problem, especially in larger battles, uh, to be able to click your individual ships, especially when they're just dying left and right. Um, but things that you have to strive to work on um, as as it slow the minor things slowly build up here and oddly enough he is splitting his forces here this cavort fleet going over this direction oh maybe not they just get caught around uh, and here we have a scout here that's doing nothing um, utilize your scouts folks cloak it put it in their enemy base you, you don't understand just how important that information is it is just absolutely vital to know what is going on with your opponent. Uh, if you don't know, you you end up in these situations where you're kind of scared of the cloud 
that fog of war. And you should just, you should attack that fog of war like you're attacking your opponent. Because if you don't, it will come back and bite you. And here we have the Klingons. Either rounding the corner or maybe finally sensing that this expansion exists here. Moving in. Going to burn down some of this. Getting that. Now, these guys need to get in the Make sure to micro. These guys need to micro properly. Um, and you can see that they are backing away from it. Uh, taking taking losses. Uh, now, the question is, is this Klingon fleet going to repair just the one ship or the entire ship? Repair this one ship. Send it around. Repair it. Yada, yada, yada. Be done with it. Here we have another guy taking unnecessary shots. There we see. Moving it away. At least he's doing that. Move these sayings in over here. Burn that down. Maybe put one of the... Do not repair all of these ships at once. Yes, I know. I'm getting... aggressive in my feedback here. Do not repair all your ships at once. Take this guy, cloak him. Take this guy, cloak him. Send him back to repair. And about two minutes, you'll have a repaired ship. You can go back to your base and go pick him back up. And you'll have not lost this whole initiative. Take these guys, come back down here. And wow, look at the Federation. I'm sorry. Do I see a second Starbase? Wow, can you say turtle? Um, and this is what happens when you let the Federation turtle. Don't let it... I mean, the, the Federation are killing themselves right now by turtling. They can't move. If you can't move, you can't win. Um, and if I were the Klingons right now, I'd just burn through this one constructor right now. You've got about a minute and a half. Okay, maybe a minute. Now, the Federation need to just... Well, the Federation are going... This is going to be interesting. Um, the Klingons need to just... Yeah, so we're just going to see what happens here. Uh, this outpost going up in about 45 seconds. Klingons cutting and running. Uh, maybe they're drawing them out, which would be a great thing. Uh, but uh, why? Jeez. Just... Yeah, Federation going to get their second outpost right next to each other. Absolutely right next to each other. Um, I mean, wow. Turtled in. The, the Klingons need to take over the entire map here and just... Yeah, absolutely. Watch this. Here, Here's this outpost going to come online right now. Um... Uh, the Klingons are going to just mince meat here as that guy's just going to get burned down. Uh, a couple of these vets here. I'm just going to tear up this fleet here. The Kavorts could just sort of back off a little bit. Uh, this one guy just needs to go back up a little bit. He is taking just a ton of damage. Oh, that. Here, this guy's taking some damage here. This guy get completely upgraded. Yep. Um, and that guy just getting slaughtered almost completely. Um, as this guy gets turned around, uh, and, uh, yeah, yeah, watch this, boom, saying getting a little bit out of position, and, um, so, yeah, the feds walled in in their own base, really, the Klingons, all they have to do, get some Veklarogs in here, and just burn stuff down, oh, Nice, a vet sing. Very nice. Well done. Um, repair your one ship. Yes, I'm screaming louder, and it just doesn't seem to be going through, oddly enough. Oh, here's another ship. Almost dead. Needs to go repair. Um, so, yeah. We'll, maybe we'll take a look at the pretty pictures in the meantime. You do have to appreciate the graphics on this. The this this game is just amazing, and to think this is a free game, so if at all possible, folks, please please donate. You know, five bucks, five rupees, five whatever you have, whatever currency you want, euros. By all means, if you can, support the team. Um, I'm sure everyone would appreciate. Uh, and uh, it's good to be green, which is the color that you get in the the, um, the forums with uh, a donation. 
So 